There's offense, defense, and then there's the third side of the ball that saved Texas Tech in arguably their two biggest conference games last season. Red Raiders beat the Oklahoma Sooners and the UT Longhorns each by a field goal in overtime, kicked by this guy, Trey Wolf. While Texas Tech rode that high for a bit, Wolf has moved on to the NFL and now the bar is set rather high for senior Gino Garcia. The redshirt senior Garcia played at Houston Baptist for three years and has been fighting for that starting spot at Tech ever since transferring. Though Tech's veteran punter Austin McNamara might just rise to the occasion, adding kicking to his resume for the NFL one day. We're going to let Mac, you know, that's one of the things that kind of uh, he wants to add to his uh, repertoire is, is being able to kick off, and he's been working on that a lot, you know, since the offseason. Um, you know, I've been proud of Gino like last year, you know, and got, got in here just like with Trey. You know, Trey had gotten beat out the year before, and, you know, I'm kind of one of those guys that, hey, let's, we're going to give you every shot in the world to win this thing. But, so I, I have, you know, all the faith in Gino. Uh, we got to find somebody else to step up as well. But, yeah, it's good that Mac, we know what Mac can do punting, but you you know, unfortunately, this conference, you got to be able to kick the ball off in the end zone as well. So, Another huge point of emphasis on this year's special teams is, of course, the punt and kickoff returns. Last year, Tech averaged 6.47 yards per punt return, and while normally the job goes to Miles Price, last year he got a little banged up. But for his senior season, Price has pretty high goals for himself. Improving on, like, the biggest thing we wanted to improve on was our kick, uh, punt return coverage. So punt return, I think, is going really well, and I'm super excited about that because I'm ready to return some. I'm trying to get some this year, so I want to lead the country in that. Special teams coach Kenny Perry said he hopes to put the speed demons on the kickoff return, ready to catch the ball and go, and wide receiver junior Jordan Brown might just be that guy, along with transfer Dre McCray, whose speed could also be the game changer on the special teams unit. And especially on kick return with JB, like, a lot of times you will see them catching the ball going backwards this year, but we're having a really huge emphasis on like we need to catch that ball going forward so we can gain that momentum and gain speed faster. So yeah, I think I think JB's going to be great at that. Faith Douglas, KLBK Sports.